Okay, so the winner. Okay, so we left about 7 a.m. We left uh, PJ. We're going to be actually heading towards uh, a very interesting event uh, on this, uh, organized by the people from DGI Malaysia and also ECS Asta City And uh, we'll be doing a very interesting drone test on the DGI Mavic Air, which, of course, my buddy Sanjeev is a huge fan of. So we'll be going through the whole entire experience. Um, probably get some behind the scenes and also um, how the both of us are going to be hugging each other to sleep tonight as well. Super hungry so we're going to go in Makan soon. So we'll see you at a Makan place now since a lot of vlogs like to show oh, I'm going to go here and eat so we'll do that too. Good morning once again. We are at the Kawasan Rehat Suramban uh, because we saw a signboard which says ANW and uh, Asanjif. Hey, when's the last time when ANW is like when I was a really tiny kid? So, yes, just check it out there. There's an ANW there, you're gonna mark it nicely. I do. Yo! So, cutting the ways, it's another three more minutes for us to reach. It's supposed to be there by 8.30, but typical Malaysians we are late. Yeah, I was just about to ask you. Okay, so what do you want to ask me? What was the theory just now? So, I have this theory uh, based on me being in three shoes, which is the organizer's shoes, the artist's shoes, and now the media shoes. Everybody has this tendency of thinking about how oh, it's okay, la sure delay one. <laughs> it's it's a Malaysian thing. This will never happen in any other country, it only happens in Malaysia. I don't know why, but that's the mentality. Sad but true. Jam, 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 jam. Where are parking? Where are parking? Yes, you are going to go to the road. Then I will ride the opposite. Opposite? Okay, thank you. Okay.
So which color is your favorite? Um, I gotta say this one. It looks very gunmetal-ish. It looks very sleek, right? So now you know. This, this, is, so, the this color. is so Marquez Brown Lee. Uh, this is hashtag white love. For those who love white color. And um, what's your experience in flying drones, man? Um, one of the reasons why I got Sandeep here is because he's a better drone pilot for me. Um, okay, not the best. Um, I get very annoyed when the battery features fast, so that's why I'm pretty excited to be having here because he has a flight time of about 21 minutes. So, no matter how, how you point the camera, it will be like all just at one angle. So with the flying camera, your angle is limitless. The front LEDs, okay, so the front LEDs when it's flying, it will be static red color. Okay, so this is to, to give you a sign to know that where the head is. Okay, so as I said, you connect everything into your remote uh, RC first. So the RC is very important. So in, drag all the way down. So it will activate, I mean it will start the engines. <laughs> if you realize when landing, it's not really that the position yeah, that you yeah. want, you can actually cancel it right away. Like right now, it's actually going down to the sand. You can press the X button. Now, done. Okay, now. That is actually, yeah, the battery indicator. So it's actually telling you that, yeah, I should come back. Oh, Eddie yeah, Blobo trying to land the Mavic Air. Houston, we landed. And we should make throttle it. those down. <laughs> Sorry, Adam. The landing space landing was moving around. <laughs> Impromptu, Adam. Tell me, how how was it compared Honestly, to the rest of the drones um, that you've flown? I've never tried the professional drones. I've tried the DJI Spark and also the Tello. You may think that it's harder to fly it because it's uh, advanced drone but honestly it's even easier to fly it, especially with the remote because I never tried the remote before I think it's amazing the pressure is on yeah so we're gonna be and then we're gonna have um, like a standoff between the different kinds of footage they have to do using the dynamic air and from there the interesting part is that you need to use the DJI for app, you know, the, the edit. So you can use Final Cut Pro like what we usually do. So that's a challenge by itself, and uh, that's going to be happening at 30. So right now, we just you know, chill with the lunch. Anyone else want to give it a try? Yeah, yeah, it's okay. <laughs> I love this. Thank you. I, I love this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, it's, it's like guy smiley. Oh, your phone, you want to charge while we okay, okay. setting or anything? Adam, how confident are you about actually going with this competition with the shots we've already got to win it? You know, during the first shot, even before it started, the moment that Sanjeev pulled the whole entire remote control, I knew you're going to win this stuff, man. <laughs> So today is the day that we will know whether or not Sanjeev ever wins a prize. I gotta say that it's really challenging editing through the DJI Go 4 app. It's not the easiest ever. But it's a challenge so 
That's the best part, right? I mean, it was not only a challenge doing the whole entire shots, but also a challenge to edit the whole entire thing, which I edited. But I think we can win this. A moment of truth. <laughs> Will Sanjeev ever win something? We all have to wait and see. Are you ready? <laughs> Video guys. Alright, so with this, I would like to thank the amazing people from DJI Malaysia and ECS Asta Senior Bahad for organizing this. A huge shout out to all the amazing colleagues or the teammates that we had, which is the guys from N Camera from Penang, uh, Stephen and Jay, Fazli from Amans, and of course my buddy Sanjeev. I uh, hope you guys enjoyed this video, and if you did, be sure to hit the thumbs up button, like, share, and subscribe to Adam Lobo TV if you haven't done so. Don't forget to hit the bell icon just next to it to get notified for my future videos. Thank you so much for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed this video once again. And I'll catch you guys in the next video. What's for lunch, Adam? <laughs> <laughs>